We just saw Demolition, and on this show I take my friends, we go see a movie, we review it here in the car, and then we have a discussion. The review video is spoiler-free, the discussion video is not, so if you're on the fence looking for a recommendation, you can watch this video to find out what we thought without getting spoiled. And if you want to see the whole version, um, including spoilers, check out the other video, uh, Demolition Movie Discussion with Spoilers. This is a... Um, drama slash comedy starring Jake Gyllenhaal um, and the basic plot is that his wife dies and he's trying to figure out a way to deal with it um, he ends up smashing a lot of things and taking a lot of things apart um, he also kind of gets into a bit of a relationship with Naomi Watts' character and her son and it is a very untraditional story um not like the romantic comedy you might expect certainly not um i expected the movie to be a lot sadder than it is and it it isn't very sad it's it's much more sort of pensive um it's trying the movie's like trying to figure itself out or the you know the main character's trying to figure out what's going on and Things come to light, and it sort of makes sense within the scope of his character and the scope of the story that they tell um, what's all going on. Everybody's character, all the characters make sense. The story arc makes sense. Um, there's some horrible things that happen in it. But I think it's one of these that I think that if you go into it, with expectations of it being kind of a tearjerker, it'll probably let you down because it's not. Um, I really liked it. I thought it was. I thought it was well done. Um, I thought Jake Gyllenhaal was was good in it, and I liked the way that it just sort of naturally flowed from um, from him kind of dealing with one character to another. They spent a lot of time with him and his father-in-law and then a lot of time with him and Amy Watts and a lot of time with him and the son and those progressions always felt natural and it, it never felt like people disappeared out of the movie they were always just sort of in you know they, they were part of what he was talking about or what he was discussing when they were when they were there so um hard to talk about this one without spoilers but um yeah, generally speaking, I, I liked it. I actually liked it more than I expected to. So, what'd you guys think? Uh, I'm kind of on the fence on the movie. Like, mm -hmm. I definitely see here that it's not the typical drama or romantic, sad or sappy movie with, you know, a partner that's lost. But I was kind of a little... I was wanting a little bit sooner for him his character to kind of come about but I mean it all kind of ties up really well the characters everybody's characters really well everybody does really well mm -hmm. um I mean yeah I'm just gonna, gonna save for the rest <laughs> but you didn't like it uh no I didn't like it it's it's definitely not a movie that I would want to see again or rush out to see it but I like sappy love movies and things like that so and Fair this enough. isn't this didn't follow this that didn't follow it at yeah. all no so it's very a uh, male it's yeah yeah mm -hmm. yeah you're right it's very much a male's perspective on how they would deal with the loss of a spouse from not showing emotion mm -hmm. from what you may think sure i can see that so yeah it just didn't hit for me Fair enough. I went in expecting a tearjerker, but I wasn't really let down by the fact that it wasn't. I was actually pleasantly surprised. The movie, it's very emotional, but it, it puts some things in there that it manages to be funny without trying to be funny. There, there are some scenes that just flow like so dark well humor. that... You could see it being a legitimate conversation between two people. And the way they react to one another is is just wonderful. Uh, I thought the movie was great. I thought the performances were great, especially the uh, 
the father. The father. Yeah. Yeah. I can't think of the actor's name. Chris Cooper. Yeah. He he did an excellent job. And Jake Gyllenhaal is always awesome. So. Yeah, I liked it too. Uh, there's a lot more like dark comedy in there than I thought it was there was gonna be. Um, I guess I liked the whole like the, this is about a guy that's totally numb and you know he's, he loses his wife and so he just takes it upon himself to want to like deconstruct things and really it's about deconstructing him and he, he never really understood himself and never understood his marriage so it's kind of about kind of like a realization kind of movie and how it gets to that point uh, I kind of I enjoyed the story I enjoyed the journey yeah so that's Demolition. If you like the way we do these reviews, please like the video, subscribe, check out all the written and video reviews at dalemaxfield.com, and thanks for watching.